Some Northeast Pennsylvania after school programs are at risk of closing their doors after not receiving grant money from the state. Fox 56's Joshua Coulomb takes us to Hazleton, where elected officials are stressing the importance of these programs. Almost 2,000 kids are at risk of losing their after school education program across 24 school districts. But it was so successful, all of the experts looked at it and said, yes, this really works, this really helps kids in need. It's grown over the years. They had no, no anticipation that suddenly uh, they would get zero dollars. State Senator David Argyle said he's making a bipartisan effort to save the schools and homes and education shine and the Schuylkill Achieve programs. Shine of Luzerne County serves at-risk students. Coordinators say it was a surprise when they found out they weren't receiving funding. Um, a program that has been vetted and has done so well and there is such a strong investment in already, we found it hard to believe that it would be discontinued. So we're a little shocked. Um, we're very hopeful that we can find a resolution to this. They also say their program doesn't just help the kids get an education, but also helps out families as well. We set parents up for WIC programs, ESL, GS, GED programs. Uh, we're connecting them with clothing rooms and food banks. So we're showing the students that their families can improve, and we want our students to know that education never ends at 12th grade. Argyll says the grants are instead going to bigger city programs, but the more rural areas need the help as well. So when you have a program that is really helping students in need, you ought not to eliminate the program. In Hazleton, Joshua Coulomb, Fox 56 News, first to 10. Senator Argyll says he plans to talk with the Department of Education and possibly hold public hearings if questions aren't answered.